good afternoon good evening good night welcome welcome thank you so much for watching another episode of kadisha cooks if you are new here i am kadisha and i'm gonna be cooking up you already know <laughs> today we are going to be making something real simple chicken and rice but to make it sound fancy we're gonna be making some barbecue chicken thighs with some seasoned white rice a side of asparagus and a side of garlic shrimp and i'm gonna also show you the reality of cleaning chicken. It ain't fun, it ain't pretty, okay? With that being said, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that notification button, comment, enough talking. We are hungry in real life, Lego. All right, all right, let's get into it. Kadisha Cooks, barbecue chicken and garlic scrump. Mm, look at that, looks so good. Again, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, let's get into this chicken thigh. So as you can see, the skin is not looking too cute. So I decided to rip that bad boy off and underneath we got a whole bunch of mucus and a fat. Yes, guys, I said this is going to be the reality, okay? So I'm just cutting off my fat. This is not for the squeamish. <laughs> Yes, look at that. It's nasty, it's mucusy. You want that off your chicken. So we're gonna go ahead and take that off. Of course, I'm gonna definitely clean it again with vinegar, lemon, you already know. But yeah, that's the reality of chicken thighs, guys. Chicken, period. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and cut out anything foreign. So that was just way too red for me. Don't know what that is, and I'm gonna cut it out. All right, we're gonna go ahead and rinse. So this is just a little short tutorial of how to clean chicken. If you want a whole tutorial, comment and make that request. This is my bowl where I went ahead and filled that up with vinegar and lemon. Boom, you got your clean chicken. Next, we got our scrimp. Okay, again, something that needs to be thoroughly cleaned, so sorry I kind of went off camera, but I cut down the middle all the way to the bottom, and as you can see, we got a little gunk there. I'm gonna show you, there you go, boom. I'm going to rinse that off. Flip the little shrimp around and devein from the bottom, especially with raw shrimp. Do not forget the bottom, look at that, big old vein. If you want a more detailed video of how I clean my shrimp and chicken, make that request, comment, hit me up, let me know. All right, now I'm gonna clean out my sink. And boom, we got our clean chicken. This is what we're gonna start off with. So you already know, I stab it up, stab it up, stab it up. Make sure all the seasonings get up in there. We got our salt, garlic powder, paprika, all purpose seasoning. And then we're gonna go ahead and mix that all together. And we got our green seasoning here. Red pepper, green pepper, onions, garlic, a whole bunch of goodness. I'm gonna put four tablespoons in there. Some dark soy sauce. Now if you want the green seasoning recipe, I'm gonna make a video about that soon, so stay tuned. We got our oyster sauce. Jerk seasoning. We're gonna go ahead and mix it all together. Mm, now you can imagine the aroma through the screen. Just imagine it. We have some time. Mix that in together and cover it up and set it aside for about 10 minutes. Then we're gonna go ahead and prepare our scrimp. So I got seven garlic cloves. And voila, does such a great job. We're gonna go ahead and prepare our beautiful shrimp. We're gonna season it with salt, pepper, shrimp seasoning, onion powder, 
paprika, garlic powder, and some garlic paste. And everything is gonna be oven baked. We're gonna set that aside. Prepare our asparagus. So we're just gonna cut about an inch from the bottom. Now we are putting our chicken on our wire rack and it's about to get into the oven. So pretty in the oven that she goes and now we have our shrimp I have some melted butter chopped up garlic and we're just gonna douse that gonna drizzle some more butter Sprinkle some parsley and into the oven they go. All right, so about 40 minutes. My chicken is looking like this. So I'm gonna mix my barbecue sauce and my honey and drizzle the chicken. Okay, and then we're gonna put them back in the oven for another 20 minutes. And boom, this is how our shrimp looks, nice, beautiful, and pink. After 20 minutes, our chicken is looking like this. We're gonna flip these bad boys around and drizzle them in our honey barbecue sauce. Okay, and after about another 20 minutes, we're going to take them out of the oven, put some more barbecue sauce after being flipped and broil it for about five to 10 minutes. And boom, this is how your beautiful plate should be looking. We got our oven baked barbecue chicken with some seasoned rice, asparagus, a side of garlic shrimp, also oven baked and corn on the cob. Yum, wow, my mouth is watering, so delicious. Thank you again for watching everyone. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and see you next week. You love the producer cook.